Subhash Chandra Bose He is considered the most influential freedom fighter with extraordinary leadership skills and a charismatic orator. He formed Azad Hind Fauz and made several contribution to India's freedom struggle. He is known for his militant approach that he used to gain independence and for his socialist policies. Sardar Vallabhai Patel, well known as Iron Man of India. He is one of the most influential politicians and freedom fighters of India. Sardar Vallabhai Patel's biggest contribution was organizing the princely states and incorporating them in the federal structure. For this reason, every year we celebrate 31st October, his birthday, as National Unity Day. The world's tallest statue, the statue of Sardar Vallabhai Patel, has been built on an island in the Narmada River near the Sardar Sarovar Dam. Manikarnika Thambe, well known as Rani Lakshmi Bai of Jansi, is known as the great patriot and one of the most important freedom fighters during the first war of independence in 1857. Although she fought primarily for her kingdom, the fact is that she refused to bow her head to the powerful, cruel and cunning British Empire. Certainly, she could not dominate the British army, but she fought till her last breath and gave her life for the sake of freedom. Valiyappan Olaganadan Chidambaram Pillai He was a Tamil Indian freedom fighter and former leader of Indian National Congress. He had set up his shipping company, Swadeshi Steam Navigation Company, in 1905 with the objective of competing against the monopoly of British India Steam Navigation Company. Bhagat Singh He was a great patriot in every sense of the word. He not only battled for the country's freedom, but he also had no qualms about giving his life in this process. His death sparked strong patriotic feelings across the country. His devotees regarded him as Martyr Shaheed Bhagat Singh is how we remember him. Tanguturi Prakasam Pantulu The first Chief Minister of New Andhra State created by the partition of Madras State along linguistic lines. He took an active part in the protests against the Simon Commission and led the successful salt march in the Madras Presidency. His valour during the protests against the Simon Commission was rewarded with the title of Andhra Kesari. Fazasi Raza, also known as Kerala Verma, hated the British East India Company officials because of their cunning and diabolic way of taking away the Indian Raja's kingdoms and subjugating Indians wherever they had British interests. Being patriotic, he could not brook injustice done to the natives and rebelled against the white rulers. His rebellion against English East India Company is known as the Kashiot War. <laughs> Shivaji Bosle, popularly known as Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj, was the founder of the Maratha Empire in the Western India. He is considered to be one of the greatest warriors of his time and even today, stories of his exploits are narrated as a part of the folklore. <laughs> 